Hi, I'm Joyce Heil, and I am excited to share a devotional with you from the Gospel of Matthew, chapter 18, verses 1 through 4. At that time, the disciples came to Jesus and asked, Who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? He called a little child and had him stand among them, and he said, I tell you the truth, unless you change and become like little children, you will never enter the kingdom of heaven. Therefore, Whoever humbles himself like this child is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. So whenever I've read this, I've thought about, of course, coming to faith in Jesus and being childlike and open and um, humble, as it says in the word. But it, last week I was thinking about children and how their default is joy and hope. You know, a child can have a bad day, but the next day they wake up, and unless they've experienced ongoing trauma, they are full of joy and hope. And this happens time and time again. And it made me think that my default mode is not joy and hope. And I'm supposed to be like Jesus. And Jesus, I think his default mode was joy and hope because of this very thing that the word is talking about. His humility allowed him to lay down any personal agenda he had as a man to go to the cross for the joy set before him and to trust that it was a good plan. So when I look at that verse about the child humbling himself, it tells me that the child is in touch with his dependence. And Far from being a burden, it is the very thing that allows the child to be joyful and hopeful. And I think that applied to Jesus. He had a very heavy load to carry, walking around as the Son of God on earth, but he was able to put his dependence in the Father and the Father's plan and therefore have joy and hope. It reminds me of uh, of the end of Job in chapter 42 after God's just shown him everything. Job says, surely I spoke of things I did not understand, things too wonderful for me to know. And wonderful there has more of a meaning of hard or difficult, things too difficult for me to know. We think of wonderful as awesome and there were awesome things that God had just explained but really it was the idea that things were too difficult for Job to really understand and there is great freedom in that there's great freedom in trusting God with the plan not just the big plan but the day-to-day -day plan so my prayer is in this season that I can be more like Jesus and that my default mode will be joy and hope Will you join me in praying for that together? Father, I thank you for this illustration of the little child standing among adults and for the humility there in a child that can run up to Jesus and not worry about the fact that he's the celebrity in town. Father, I thank you for his dependence, the child's dependence on the adult. And I pray that you would help me grow in joy and hope as I depend on you. Help us all, Lord, to be more childlike. Humble, yes, but a humility that leads to a default mode of joy and hope. In Jesus' name, amen. Thanks.